Hello guys, who here, back with another video. This time around, we are finding a winner for the Transmog competition. And I gotta say, it, it's one of the best ones so far. If you might be wondering, if you, like as a regular P person watching my videos, and you might be wondering why there's not a lot of videos coming out, I tried to explain it uh, in other videos as well. But as right now, I'm streaming the game or Trove a lot because uh, first of all, I want to give back to the community because there's drops going on right now. You have about a week to get them still. It, it end on the 8th of July. So make sure you put in your time if you haven't done so yet. And also I want to show Gamigo that this is a great idea to do these drops. And I hope they do this in the future. Maybe not like a couple of months, but like in maybe half a year, do the same thing or have something going uh, minor because these uh, drops are pretty big you know there you get a full dragon and such and they're pretty cool things and a daily thing with just five caches so watching 30 minutes of my stream for example or any of the other ones that are there that says drops activated in the bottom those are you know them as well so i just came off for five hours of streaming uh, fortunately had a little mishap in the end with uh, you know something messing up I don't know if it was twitch or it wasn't my internet I checked the internet it wasn't mine I don't know if there was a program I was using but we did fi get five hours in and then it started kind of uh, stuttering and such but you know enough about that but yeah I'm trying to go for partner if you don't know I'm gonna try my best to do so so if you um, you like my content here you're pretty sure I'm not, you're also gonna love my content on twitch and yeah I did send in my application if you follow on discord as well if you want to like see it live or you want to be on a discord or anything like that it's all there in description and this is also why we have this whole transmog competition we got a plenty of people to see today so with that said i hope you guys are going to join me uh, looking at all these so let's jump into the very first uh, competitors all right so here we go guys here is the contestants of this week week four uh, comp transmog competition in trove so again thank you all so much for joining it's super awesome i love these pictures uh i do have some feedback i guess i want to give all of them and and stuff like that but we'll go over each and one of them and then you know i'll cut again and you guys are gonna see who the winner is after me looking extra carefully on every single picture so again thank you so much for joining and here we go so first we got asel here is asel a very cool uh, really or Asil, is that how you say it? Anyways, the four, I'm sorry if I butcher any of your guys' names, but very cool picture. I really, really like this one. I like what you did. And I don't think this is... Um, I'm just going to assume that everything you guys did was with complete uh, know what you're doing. Like if you know know-how or whatever. Uh, because I see this in the background. I see you. the moon is just like just over that and you have the moon like right on you. And I don't think that's a coincidence. And, you know, for you or somebody's like, oh, yeah, there was just coincidence. But I don't think it is. And it works really, really well. I love the background, all that. It really looks like the theme of my, actually, my YouTube. I could use this, actually, as a background for something. It's really, really cool. The only thing I'm missing is, like, a, maybe a mount or an ally. But if it doesn't work for you, if this, if you tried with, like, a mount and you said, like, that's too much, you can also overdo it. It's not like, hey, I'm just going to put everything in there and just put it, like, there. Uh, also, your wings, I really like those. Maybe the water wings would be awesome as well here, but... That's something you should try out and see if that works. If it doesn't, like it could also be too watery, right? It could be like, it does have to come together, but it, it also has to come together as creative and looks aesthetically pleasing, right? It shouldn't just be, hey, I'm just going to put all the water stuff po on and I'll just, just put all the other things on because that. But I really love this picture and I love the moon in the background. Really well done. This is one I'm... But I uh, overall like one of the best pictures ever, right? Like it's just really, really cool. We have had some great ones, but these are pretty cool. And here we got uh, bear steel kills. I know I'm a little bit over here uh, in my face, but I do want you guys to see my reaction to all these pictures and see my 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 mood, I guess. But uh, he's doing one of the classic ones, the fire one, really, really cool. I think you're missing a little bit on the costume. It doesn't really fit the theme. Uh, also with a purple and stuff like that and maybe you don't have that but the bird is, is fitting and also of course being in the lava is uh, pretty awesome and I do like your cornerstone but I don't know if it fits into the transmog like it's not a uh, you know competition around who has the prettiest cornerstones that Lord Faffy has actually done something like that has it done like a cornerstone competition 
but we're doing more of a transmogative person. And I'm probably also going to say this later, but it doesn't have to be in a specific biome. You can use, uh, you can use what is called uh, club biomes and stuff like that, or like being in a club. And if there's something that fits in there, you can do it so as well, right? That fits your theme or whatever it is. You're welcome to use. So you don't have to be in a biome that uh, is in a, you know, public one, if that makes any sense. But yeah, very cool. I like the, I like yours pictures as well. Very, really well done as well. Uh, small tweaks here and there. But here we got uh, Creative Genius. So Creative Genius, he made this one as well. He's with the Neon City a theme. That's also a very common theme. That doesn't make it less impressive though. So I really like your costume. I would like to see a little bit more zoomed in maybe. I don't know, but at least I would like to have removed the UI. Uh, you do that by going into your settings uh, you go down to hotkeys and you scroll down and just before you say take screenshot There's also something that says toggle UI mine is set to U, uh, U7 I was about to say F7 So when I hit F7 it kind of moves the whole uh, overlay and that just makes it uh, a little bit more pleasing I would say to do remove that and also you won't have like the chat on if somebody's like chatting and stuff like that That will be in your picture as well. So Kind of maybe if you're trying to get rid of it, you have to wait until it goes, it disappears, right? But you can just do that with the F7 or whatever it's binded for you to remove that UI. But really well made, creative. I really like it. Uh, the whole thing really comes together. And again, I would maybe see a maybe maybe a mount or something like that if you uh, have it to work. But it, that's not really the big deal. The, the most is is about the the UI for sure. But Let's move on to the next one. Here we got DWB and he's taking a picture with his phone. And I kind of like that in a way if it kind of creates a filter around it. But um, we, a screenshot would probably have been better. Uh, also, you know, as again, with the UI, kind of toggle it off if you have the opportunity to do so. But the, I can see your transmog and I really like that, how simple it is. I really like how that, that works out. So... Uh, other than that, I really like your transmog for sure. Maybe the glasses could have been something different, but uh, I love the halo and, and the, sh the sword especially. So maybe think about, you know, maybe taking a screenshot or something like that next time and just keep going with the, um, you know, with the theme. I really appreciate it. So next up, we got ourselves Frail. Frail right here. Uh, that's why I talked about before. I did see this picture and I think this is not in a... Um, in a neon city biome because the backgrounds and stuff like that it doesn't look like the one that's from there <laughs> i might be wrong it might be in some side uh, inside something but that's okay that's cool it doesn't have to be in the biome but if you want to use some themes from a biome you can do that or you want to use some themes from a club world whatever fits you is really uh, up to you whatever it just has to come together and you also remove the ui you're having a pose seeing everything as well and i really love what you did with this picture really cool and very simple but very awesome indeed. I don't know if the purple wings work in this, but it does work for your costume. Uh, and Neon City biome is just like, it's so colorful in, in a way, even though being very dark, uh, you can, it's basically a contrast to each other, right? But I really love what you did with this one, Frail. So thank you so much for, for competing. And we are moving on to Kaz. Here we got Kaz and really the whole thing here also really works together. You are in a mount. Um, if I really want to be nitpicking, I don't know if you guys can see it, it's right over uh, there, oh, there, 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 there. In the uh, ally, you can see it's not really an ally. Uh, you can reskin your allies as well, you know. I know it's a little thing, but in, in these hard competitions where I really have to do all that, it, it really has to be uh, nitpicking sometimes about it. It, it. it might be better if we just do it randomly and everybody that posts this, but I think we have to acknowledge the whole, um, what's it called? Uh, people really taking their time because else you could just post a picture if it's just going to be random, right? But we, we do want to uh, have people use their creativity. And of course that makes it a lot harder on me to pick a winner, but that's just it is. But yeah, I really love your theme. And of course I love the simple mount you used as well. Uh, unfortunately, we can't really see your wings either, but maybe it works without the wings. Maybe the wings wouldn't would have been too much in, in the whole thing, right? So Kaz, really awesome. I love the picture as well. Really well made. 
really well done as well. And next we got Sam. Here we got Sam. And he is really rocking this one. He uh, is fighting. That's He's using a club world. This is, of course, not a, anything. And you're much welcome to do so. But a uh, statue in the background is very impressive. Very impressive indeed. But this is not like a club world. Uh, so, But I will like take it into consideration. But it's mostly how you then, of course, uh, put it all together. So, yeah, it's not... I'm not being... If you should be the winner, for example, it's not because of the... the statue in the background just want to make that sure when i tell people now that it's not going to be uh because of that if you are going to win but i'm just saying it's a very very cool one and you did an amazing job on this one for sure and there's not really much to say other than what i just said i guess <laughs> so yeah uh, let's move on to the next one very well done sam really uh really impressive so next we got uh sgtm and he also went with the whole uh, fire biome thing. Uh, again, I would have liked to see uh, maybe, unfortunately, your uh, your little uh, you know minion for your tomb raider is kind of blocking some of the view of the uh, different things and stuff like that. But you did went into a fire world and you're on a fire mount. Again, I would like to see the UI being taken off, maybe. But that's really up to you what you want to do but i'm just saying it might give you a few extra points just taking the ui off because it just makes the whole screenshot come together better that is nothing is blocking it basically also unfortunately the, the minion is there but of course you can't control that because you're on a uh, tomb razor so maybe uh, we have seen some tomb razors in the past that actually has done pretty well around that but yeah all that but I think that was it. Yeah, that was it for all of the costumes. I'm going to be back in a little second and I'm going to be back with the winner. I know it took a while to go through all this, but uh, I just want to make everybody feel like they did a really good job because really everybody really did a great job. So I'll be right, right back with the winner. See you in like one second. And we are back, guys. And as you probably can see on the screen right here, congratulations, Azil, Azil, and... I'm not sure if I'm saying it correctly, but you are the winner. Thank you so much for participating. I just think that this one came so in so simple. And there was a lot of great ones that gotta be... There's a few that had to work a little bit. I talked about that before. But my God, this this is amazing. Thank you so much for, uh, for, for participating. And just great job, everyone. There was a really, really close race. I had a super hard time doing this, guys. Seriously, this was so hard to pick a winner. Guy, dang, that was hard to find. But thank you so much all for the participating. I hope you guys are going to join for the next one. I know some maybe feel like it's a, I don't I feel like it's a pretty easy way to earn 100,000 like uh you know, yeah, you you took a great job and you had a, you know, interest in but I do think you guys did an amazing, amazing, amazing job. Thank you guys so much for all participation. And I, Aisle, I will contact you on Discord right now and let you know that you have won. So again, GG to everybody. Thank you so much for participating. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for joining it once again. And congrats on the 100k. And again, you know, if you just went to the end, you should probably also talk, see the intro that I did because I talked about a few things about the channel. But it's not like a big announcement, anything, I guess. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you in the next one or live. Bye.